Everyone grab some crayons, pencils, markers, whatever, and get ready to learn how to draw Jesus the coked up chick, and I'll show you step by step on the iPad using Procreate. Jesus is the star of Jesus the Coked Up Chicken, co-star of Ethel the Cyborg Ninja, Lord Carnage, and the upcoming Cosmic Death Brick book series. He's a fairly simple character to draw, but he does have a lot of personality and many, many different expressions, infinite expressions that change depending on what he's reacting to or how much space coke he may or may not have had. Usually quite a bit. So let's get started. How to draw Jesus. Here's a page of more or less complete artwork from uh, Jesus the Coked Up Chicken issue number three. A couple shots of Jesus, edit station one. I'll do edit station one in a different video, but let's go up here to an untitled artwork panel and we're going to draw Jesus the Coked Up Chicken. I typically do this in two layers, so sometimes I can get it right on one layer for demonstration purposes here, since I'm going to be doing this quickly, one take. I'm going to go through two layers. I'm going to go with uh, my Ink Pen 2, one of my favorites. Nice, quick lines. All right, going to do a fairly standard side front side view of Jesus here. Normally go with uh, his right eye first. You can adjust his, his pupils never line up. Like he's never actually focusing on anything ever. And there's a couple different ways you can draw the mouth. You go with the beak, Got like a little eyebrow thing there. Bring the head around. And that's, that's how you draw his, his head for the most part. And then there's one, two, three, four spikes on his hair, all right? Now, here's where you can get a little creative if you're drawing Jesus. Let's say he's looking at something and he's genuinely confused, which is, you know, most of the time. I like to draw his mouth like that, or well, that's sad, sorry, a little, a little too much. There we go. That's, that's a good Jesus confused look right there. I like that one. I use that one a lot. He's, someone's talking to him, he's looking at something. Huh? All right. Now we can also uh, go in here and change his expression. Keep the same top of his mouth or beak since he's a bird, space chicken. Let's make him happy. Might pull this part back a little bit. There, now Jesus is happy. Maybe he's saying something, there's his tongue. His whole expression changes with his beak. Let's go in here and do another one. Jesus in matter of fact conversation. does occasionally happen. In fact, he kind of, he takes the lead in his own book after uh, hanging out at the bar for a while with Space Scar. You'll see. It ends up um, becoming quite the leader. There we go. So that's a matter of fact. He's looking up and down at the same time. Now let's do uh, one last expression here. Actually, I'm gonna start over. I, 
my brain needs like needs a reset on this one. Rarely do I go in and alter his um, expression on the fly like that. Ah, that eye sucks. Let's check that. There we go. Adjusting his eyes like that tilts his head, and then you don't see the underside of his beak. I think there actually probably is a little bit more complexity to drawing Jesus than I'm admitting here. Um, all right. Fairly simple geometric character, but he does have a lot of personality, especially now that he's on his third book. Like his sixth comic book outing all right so we're gonna ink this one and yeah you can do all kinds of weird things with him like one of my favorites is when he's really having some issues just to hang his tongue out of the side of his mouth a couple different ways i can draw that but not for uh, this, this this drawing we're gonna go in here and ink For those of you who asked on the website, how do you draw Jesus? Oops, wrong layer. Um, repetition is the answer. Just it's like anything in drawing. Just free your mind, get out there and make a ton of mistakes until you stop making as many mistakes. Let me go with studio pen. Repetition, repetition, repetition. Practice. Now for a big drawing like this, I don't usually draw them this big actually, I'm gonna increase the pen size. For the larger lines, I do tend to go with the G Pen Streamline, one of my manga pens. See, it gives a nice big thick line, kind of smooths it out a bit. But the one, one of the good things about drawing Jesus, at least I think, is that he really doesn't have any straight lines. Some janky lines actually work pretty well for him. Actually, his uh, his chest hair <laughs> ruffles a little lower than that. They're down, they're down here. But... Put his tongue in there. Nope. Drop in the black. Lots of different ways I draw his pupils. Depends on what he's doing, really. Depends on the scene. For demonstration purposes, here I'm going to do them like this. Sometimes I'll leave them just totally white like that. Other times, give them more detail. All right, that's black. We're gonna come in here and I'll draw the big reflections. Take off the sketch layer. going to print I'd probably clean it up a little more but this line here is a little, a little rough so what the heck we'll go in there and clean it up just had like three cups of coffee so my hands pretty much bouncing all over the place right now I don't usually put too much detail on Jesus otherwise. I mean, sometimes I'll put bags under his eyes if I feel like it helps with the drawing, but normally he just ends up looking like that. Kind of crazy, a lot like Jesus. There he is. Happy drawings. 
See you next time on How to Draw with me and your friend Jesus. Maybe he's slobbering. It's always a good effect from him. Now you're on your way at becoming a master at drawing Jesus the coked up chicken. I'll show you how to draw his body and tail and feet in a different video. But until then, practice, 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 and I'll see you next time.